So for those of you who are oh. just tuning in, we are at the Santa Cruz Basin, which is about 50 miles off the coast of Santa Monica. Um, and we are looking exclusively at the geological key, or the canyon right here at the basin. Actually, we just collected our last rock sample for this dive. Um, and the San East Santa Cruz Basin fault system is a complex fault system. It's compri comprised of several strands. It is a reactivated east dipping fault that is now one accommodates ones, right? oblique reverse motion. Uh, so yeah. we based our dive off some of some seismic profiles. Front. We're diving yeah, that one right there. from the base of the canyon Fantastic. up a slope, Thank you. Yep. looking for structures in the canyon wall that may help us characterize the fault Second system. Do you want to zoom in at all anymore? I mean, if you guys want to, that's fine, but I got a good overview of okay. the crab fall. Yeah, I'm not sure how many of those yeah, are actually alive. Yeah. Some of them are, are alive. We're here. Yeah, so a little bit. Do we have a data fusion algorithm that integrates both sonar and camera data, or do we have, or do, you, or do we do that independently? Yeah, it's independent. It's independent, as a, and and as far as I know, there is not much being done in merging uh, profiling sonar as the ones we have on Hercules and Argos and camera image. I know there has been some work using camera imaging and multi-beam mega sounders, uh, but I don't think there has been many using the pencil beam uh, profiling sonars that as like the ones we have here. All right, are we zoomed in at all, or is it just in past the arm? Um, we're, go we're going slightly past the arm, that's about it. Okay. Um, what do scientists use to make their sandwich? Peanut butter and jellyfish. <laughs> <laughs> I think these get funnier the later the watch gets. <laughs> <laughs> um, why can't you hear a pterosaur go to the restroom? Because the pee is silent. 